Russia appears to be clapping back at the US with a release video of an exoskeleton suit that is, for now, just a prototype. The exosuit was first introduced at Moscow's National University of Science and Technology. State-owned RT called the suits Star Wars-like because stormtroopers. You can see the suit includes some sort of heads-up display for the face and is basically designed for maximum toughness. However, this Galactic Empire moment was really first conceived of by the U.S. military when it officially introduced what it called an Iron Man suit in 2013 in a partnership with DARPA. Special operations spokespeople say they're on their fifth prototype of the U.S.'s tactical light operator suit and will begin hardcore testing next summer. By the way, shortened, that suit is named Talos, which is also the name for a large automaton made of bronze in a Greek myth, which went about an island and protected it from pirates. Makes sense. Various companies in the US still show off their versions of this kind of tech, wrapping in night vision, oxygen, communications, sensors, and computers, all into a suit that protects most of a person's body in armor while carrying any weight placed on it. This might seem like it would cost a heck of a lot of money, but remember, the Department of Defense already spends a lot on gear per average soldier. The AP says it's about 17,000 now and projected to grow to almost 60,000. Special operators like elite Navy SEALs will be wearing the Talos suit first, so God knows how much that will be. See you tomorrow.